Airlines for its top-of-the-line safety upgrades. It has features like curved hallways designed to keep students alive during a mass shooting. But today, Fox 17's Julie Dunmire spoke to those who are saying goodbye now to the old building. What if you got the chance to walk the halls of your high school one last time? Would you remember where your chemistry class was or your locker combination? Today, Fruitport alumni got to do just that. From the first graduating class of Fruitport Trojans and on. They get to see that little piece of history still. These hallways hold a lot of memories. This was uh, chemistry and advanced algebra. It's sad that it's coming down, but to see all of the exciting things that are happening for our community and for our kids, um, that's why we wanted to do it. But none are quite as powerful right here. as Mr. Zorn's. Mr. Zorn was a great counselor. Because his memory is fading. I just want to see some of the old buildings and some of them I have my friends that I taught with. Mr. Zorn was a counselor here for more than three decades. He taught a lot of kids. I was a decent student, but I, I would slack off and he'd catch me at it and ask me why and get me geared in the right direction. And four years ago, he was diagnosed with Alzheimer's. It brings back memories, happy memories. This trip through his old school to his old office feels familiar. I like the kids. They were friendly. They were my kind of kids. The kids are grown up now and are pretty fond of Mr. Zorn themselves. Perfect. Because after all, the memories will be missed just as much as the building that held them. Gonna miss it a lot. December 21st, the walls of the old Fruitport High School will start to come down. Students will move into the new building after holiday break. In Fruitport, Julie Dunmire, Fox 17 News. How about that?